For over 50 years, Rivers Edge Garden Center has been Framingham's favorite place for everything for the garden. Business Beat reporter Meredith McCunis recently visited to check out the local color. We are here at the Rivers Edge Garden Center, where Jennifer Porter shows us what her garden has grown to today. Well, I've been working here at Rivers Edge pretty much my whole life, or at least since I was about 10 years old. So when my parents bought the house, which is located next door, uh, there was a little greenhouse on the back and there was a two-car garage. So they converted the garage into a florist shop, which my parents ran, or my mom ran when we were kids, uh, even before we were born. And then it slowly emerged into selling annuals and so forth off the driveway. And then my dad built coal frames in the area where we're standing now. Then he replaced those with greenhouses and it just got bigger and bigger and bigger. I think people like the setting. It's a beautiful setting on the river. People come in here, they meet, they see their friends. Um, I think we have a great selection, we have great music, we have great employees, and that brings us great customers, and it just seems to all work. People come in all the time and they say how that sign makes them so happy because they know spring is coming. As I walked around the garden center, I was excited to find such a variety of plants. We grow a lot. Um, when we started the business a long time ago, my parents did, they grew almost everything. We have tons of annuals, perennials, herbs, um, hard to find herbs. Um, I have an herb grower that helps me out in Groton who has amazing selection. We do beautiful hanging baskets, there's climbing vines, rose bushes. I also found that Jennifer had some fuzzy friends to greet her customers. I was telling a customer today, I said, I remember when people used to come in to see me and now they come in to see my dogs. Um, my, we had Pedro who was a big mascot here for a long time and he passed away. But, um, and people still ask for him, which really makes me happy. And we still have Annie and Sylvia and people love to come out and they pet them. If they're not out, they ask if I can go in the house and get them. But people love to come and see the dogs. Oh, they definitely do. The thing that's most important to me in the future, which I love to see, is people that have shopped here and their children have shopped here, and then all of a sudden, they're, they're, I feel old, their kids are grown up and they're shopping here. And that's really probably the thing in the future I would most like to see. Um, but I just like to see it kind of going as it is, as a nice local business, people with smiles on their faces still coming here. For the Business Beat, I'm Meredith McCunis.